Debunking the myths regarding coronavirus. Coronavirus is threatening the world with its dangerous and viral spell. It has affected many people and damaged people in various ways, but this virus is being presented not the way it actually is. Yes, there is a possibility of you believing in myths about the coronavirus that you've heard on TV. Let's take a look at the famous coronavirus myths and discover the reality behind these myths. Myth number one, getting coronavirus means immediate death. This just isn't simply true. You might think like that, but the truth is the opposite. It is similar to seasonal viruses leading to the flu, cold, or mild pain. Only 2% of people have been critically ill due to this virus and have developed pneumonia out of this virus. This happens to patients with weak immunities or a detailed medical history with various diseases. Myth number two, coronavirus is the worst virus ever. People call this virus as the deadliest virus ever, which isn't true. Coronavirus is not as fatal as it is perceived to be. You have a high chance of recovery from coronavirus if you have strong immunity and you are vaccinated against pneumonia. You can only get seasonal influenza and fever after infection. Myth number three, wearing a mask can protect you from coronavirus. This is the craziest myth of them all. You might think or have heard that people say wearing a mask will protect you from the virus in the air. Yes, wearing masks is a preventative measure for coronavirus, but this is not the ultimate solution to prevent the virus. Coronavirus might transfer via surfaces of contact between people. You might wash your hands, keep separate stuff for your use, and clean your place for more precautions against the virus. Myth number four, coronavirus originated from a bat and snake soup. This is a perception that developed among the Western world and traveled all along to the East. You might also think this was hinting at the diet plan of China where this virus had originated. The truth is that this disease broke out from a vet market where there are a large number of animals. We can't specifically target bats and snakes though as the source of this virus. Myth number five, a package shipped from China is infected with coronavirus. Seriously, this myth is laughable at best. Many people actually believe that using Chinese stuff or shipping items from China would carry the virus to them and they'll be infected. Come on, whenever items are shipped, they are seal packaged. You remove the seal pack before using the items. The articles within the package are entirely safe from the virus, even if there was a possibility of an infected person treating the package during the shipping process. And amazingly, this virus can't survive long outside the human body due to unfavorable conditions. You can also get rid of the virus using bleaches and cleaning chemicals on surfaces. Myth number six, closing borders can stop the coronavirus from spreading. This is what's done by most countries. China has been blocked down by many countries that have denied flight operations. They have also evacuated their people from this region. The virus may travel distances through the air, so it shouldn't be treated as something inhuman happening there. Myth number seven, only Chinese people have coronavirus. As soon as the virus broke out in the Chinese province of Wuhan, people developed the perception that it could only affect the Chinese people as they are the ones who eat bats and snakes. By this time, the myth has proved itself to be wrong. This virus has spread in more than 40 countries and has affected more than 100,000 people to date. Myth number eight, the virus only affects older people. Although the highest ratio of mortality due to coronavirus consists of old people, we can't say that coronavirus affects old people only. Cases of infants and young people have been reported who are infected with the coronavirus. This mortality rate of older people is due to the weak immunity of these people, which is the critical factor of coronavirus becoming critical. Myth number nine, the coronavirus is somewhat related to Corona beer. Corona beer is a popular beer around the world. You might think this beer is slightly related to the coronavirus, but this is a total myth. The only relation between the two items is the same name, Corona. Myth number 10, my pet could give me a virus. 
people think coronavirus came from animals, including bats and snakes, this might make you believe that animals carry this virus and so do your pets. This is the truth, that an animal version of this virus also exists. However, if your pets are properly vaccinated, you don't need to worry about them. You won't get infected with the virus from them. Myth number 11, some powers that be created coronavirus and spread it deliberately. This is a myth that has come out after the revolution of some book snippets and cartoons of the 20th century, which have talked about something similar to coronavirus. People have started to think that coronavirus is something pre-planned. This is not a fact. This might be a coincidence among the books and cartoons, but coronavirus wasn't planned. If it had been expected, there might be a solution discovered earlier to avoid this mortality rate. Myth number 12. Antibiotics can treat this virus. Many countries have a belief that coronavirus is similar to seasonal influenza and that it can be treated with topical medicines that are often prescribed for seasonal flu, fever, and others. This is not true. You can get yourself in further danger by using antibiotics for a viral infection. Don't be a doctor if you're not one. Myth number 13. If you get pneumonia vaccines, you'll stay safe from coronavirus. Doctors have revealed that coronavirus in severe cases turns into a pneumonia-like disease that damages the lungs. Pneumonia-like disease which damages the lungs. This is not pneumonia. So you can't say if pneumonia vaccines can prevent you from getting the coronavirus. No, it's more likely your strong immunity keeps you in a safe place from coronavirus. Myth number 14, coronavirus and SARS are the same. In 2003, China was struck with a deadly SARS virus, which affected many people and left 7,000 plus casualties. This coronavirus is not the same SARS virus. Both of these are different. The primary symptoms might be the same as fever, flu, and pain, but the final impact is far different. There are other differences as well. We'll get into an in-depth discussion if we start comparing coronavirus and SARS. So for now, SARS and coronavirus are two different things. Myth number 15. Coronavirus is equivalent to a seasonal winter flu. Many people who were infected with coronavirus and later recovered say that the pain and suffering while being in coronavirus was less or equivalent to the pain in a seasonal winter flu. Flu is just a symptom of the coronavirus attack. Myth number 16. You will be infected with coronavirus if you stay with an infected person for 10 minutes. You might think that being in the vicinity of a person affected with coronavirus for 10 minutes can be dangerous for you, but this is not the truth. Although you have a higher chance of getting the coronavirus with some physical closeness to the person, but this virus can also transfer via contaminated surfaces and used items such as clothes, towels, and others. Myth number 17, coronavirus is not curable. People believe coronavirus can't be cured at all. This is somehow true that no real treatment of this disease has been discovered yet, but more than 12,000 people with less infectious coronavirus have already recovered from the virus and returned to their happy life. As mentioned, there is only 2% chance of getting a severe coronavirus case. Myth number 18, we all will die in the case of a pandemic. A pandemic is a condition when the world declares a medical emergency due to an outbreak of a new disease worldwide. This can lead to a massive impact on people and can lead to severe panic among them. You might think that the pandemic will be disastrous and we all would die ultimately, but this is not true. A spread of the disease can definitely be cured with preventative measures and attempts to discover the cure. Myth number 19, garlic and ginger can prevent you from coronavirus. Some Eastern herb specialists say that ginger and garlic can cure coronavirus or at least keep you away from the disease. This remedy can keep you away from the flu and fever, but if the virus enters your body, you won't have any chance to skip from flu, illness, pain, and other symptoms to show that you are infected. And finally, myth number 20, red marine algae is sufficient for coronavirus. Red marine algae is a common remedy observed to stop most viruses worldwide. Many people have advised leaving infected people of coronavirus in a mild colony of red marine algae for the entire day, and this will absorb all coronavirus in the body. The truth is that this algae is not found to be useful for coronavirus. 
There is simply more information we need to discover to effectively control coronavirus. Until then, most prevention is advised. I think it's time we get over these myths. Share any myths you've heard about the coronavirus and we'll debunk them for you. Stay strong and don't listen to fake news articles around the internet. To sum it all up in one sentence, your chance of winning a lottery, which is 1 in 40 million, is more than getting the COVID-19 or coronavirus. Together, we will defeat the coronavirus.